Welcome to an introduction to basic concepts of maintenance and reliability. In this lecture, we are going to understand the basic concept of reliability. The meaning of the term reliability can easily be understood for any person who understands English language. It is the quality of being able to be trusted or believed because of working or behaving well. So a machine is reliable if you can trust it and depend on it to do its job without breaking down. However, what's important to understand is how reliability is defined in a specific manner in an industrial and technical context. In this regard, the United States Military Standard on Maintenance and Reliability has been one of the earliest comprehensive references on the matter. It defines reliability in two ways. First, the duration or probability of failure-free performance under stated conditions. Second, the probability that an item can perform its intended function for a specified interval under stated conditions. Other standards and literature also define the term reliability in more or less the same way. So let us break down this verbose definition into digestible parts. These definitions are covering the same meaning as in plain English language. However, there are three important elements to be taken away from this definition. First, reliability is actually a probability. Therefore, whenever reliability is expressed, it is expressed as a percentage chance. We will further expand on it when we'll look at the mathematical expressions discussing reliability. Second, reliability is dependent on conditions in which a machine is operating. If conditions change, reliability of a machine can change. As a quick example, if you drive your car on a good paved road, it will have a less chance of breaking down than if you drive it off-road on rough terrain. As a result, your car is same, but it will be more reliable when driven on a paved road and it will be less reliable when driven on a rough terrain. Third, reliability is also time-bound. It depends on time interval or time duration of operating a machine. What that means is that if you are driving your car on a rough terrain for 10 minutes, it will have a less chance of breaking down than if you drive it over rough terrain for 10 hours. Therefore, the car is same and the terrain is also same. However, what is different is the time duration for which your car is driven under stated conditions. To sum it up, Reliability is a probability that a machine will not break down and that probability is dependent on under what conditions is the machine operating under and for how much time. So the correct way of describing reliability of your car would be that the car has a reliability of 75% to run over rough terrain for 10 hours. This statement would express that there is a 75% chance that your car won't break down under stated conditions and a specified time interval. This chance can vary if you either vary the conditions or the time interval. In this way, whenever we describe reliability in an industrial and engineering context, we always specify the three elements, that is, probability, conditions, and time. In the next lecture, we are going to look at the mathematical side of reliability, that is, 
how it is calculated.